Sports for Real again with Coach Hall. Today we're going to talk about when Michigan has the ball against the TCU defense. You already know what time it is when Michigan has the ball. They're going to pound it, pound it, and pound it early on in the game to get a crack in that foundation of the defense, and then they're going to start doing that play-action pass. And when you start sneaking all those people up to try to stop the run, they're going to try to drop it right over your head. Then they're going to start pounding it some more. So by the time you get to the second half, the floodgates are open. Michigan so far has been averaging 40 points a game. So you know it all has to start somewhere, and it all begins with that powerful running game. On the flip side, TCU, they're going to come up that 3-3-5 defense. They rug it up front. They can get there and they stop that run. And those guys like to play man-to-man -man coverage. They're going to blitz. They're going to blitz and back it up with some rough man-to-man -man coverage. And i tell you something else. TCU, they aren't bothered by the challenge of going against Michigan. Matter of fact, I heard some of the players say this kind of reminds them of the Texas game where they had that B. John Robinson. B. John Robinson is a tough running back. He's a bad dude. But they were able to bottle him up. But not necessarily bottle him up, but he never got off track. And because he never got off track, Texas never really got going. So the plan is to do the same thing against Michigan as they did against Texas. They have the talent on the outside to do exactly what they need to do. But the key is, can they stop the run? If they can slow the run down and put pressure on those receivers of man-to-man -man coverage, they have a great chance. And i tell you one other thing. Just like Ohio State, they're going to challenge the quarterback to beat them. And these defenders for TCU are better than what Ohio State has. So the challenge really is can you keep the game close? Can you withstand that depth advantage that Michigan has over TCU. But Michigan, you already know what they're going to do. They're going to pound the rock. They're going to play action pass. And they're going to throw it deep. And they're going to do it over again. So it's up to TCU. Just like the offense has to stay on schedule, the defense has to keep everything in front of them. And they're going to have to tackle and keep the game close. If they can do that, then they stand a much better chance than the experts give them. Sports for real.